Hi, it's math time again with Mrs. Depper Smith. I thought I'd introduce you to Daisy today because she's here in the office with me and she's been interested about what's going on in here when I'm talking to myself with the computer on. Maybe you can see there's the back of her. She's laying on the floor behind me. I'll move my chair just a bit. Bring the camera over closer. Daisy. Hey Daisy. You want to say hello? There's Daisy and Lola, of course. What's happening? Daisy's looking around. Hey, Daisy, Daisy. There's Daisy. Look. We're making a math video for multiplication. Let's see if I can tip the camera. I have a very short cord here, so it's giving me some trouble. All right, Daisy. Have a seat. We're going to work on this math video, and you can listen in. Once again, we're practicing some multiplication. I've got um, four more problems with you, and we will discuss all the answers at school. Please make sure that you stop the video, answer these on paper, and life will be wonderful. First off, please calculate the answer for 206 times 7. I'm excited about this one because we had a zero to use for multiplying and that gives us one free, kind of a free pass. It's a number that we don't have to work very hard on to calculate. The right answer is 1,442. Now, please go ahead and work the multiplication problem 206 times 77. Stop the video and do the work. I'll show the answer in a few moments. much better. I have to fix my scarf. As you can see this time, I have blocked out some of the unanswered um, digits. Hopefully, you were able to calculate the correct answer for this one. We've been playing the game at school where some of the numbers are gone from the answer. And I'll tell you what they need to be when we review these problems at school. Your next problem will be 463 times 8. Stop the video and go to work. I have a particular nose today. Here it is. The answer is 3,704. Now work on the problem 463 times 88. Once again, we've got some of the digits blocked, blacked out, and we'll talk about what they need to be when we um, review this problem at school. And that's all for today. I hope you're getting faster and more comfortable with multiplying bigger numbers. As always, we'll talk about these at school. Please turn your paper in to my white mail basket on the shelf by the um, electric pencil sharpener. Have a great day, and please remember to always be kind. I'll see you at school.